I'm interested in how we can back up our WordPress website without the use of a plugin. The best way to do that is to go through phpMyAdmin and if you're on cPanel, which a lot of people are, your dashboard will look something like this. The design might be a bit different, the colours might be a bit different, but in principle it's all the same and you should have something called phpMyAdmin which you can click under databases. This is where your WordPress database is stored. Now this database is just called WordPress. And what I'm interested in doing is exporting these tables here. And make sure that all the tables in the database is selected. Make sure that SQL is selected and make sure that these boxes are checked. Usually you can export it with the defaults and compression I'll say none and I'll click go and it will ask us to save the SQL file. I suggest you create a dedicated folder and save it. There's one that I made earlier. I'll save over that. So let's imagine that something happens to the website. Let's say there's a hack. Your website gets hacked and these tables get disrupted. Well, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to wipe them out completely. So I'll, because this is what you would do anyway. You would have to do a, like a, a hard reset. You could probably drop all of your tables. So I'll say check all and then drop and say yeah. Now when I come back to the website and click refresh we should get, ah oh, there we go, so it's just reset basically and it thinks that WordPress isn't installed. So what would, I, what would I do in this situation? Well I'd go back to this database WordPress and I'd go to import and I'd go browse and then I would look for that SQL file that I saved and it's in the folder called database. You click go, import the database. So let's just get rid of that and access the WordPress front page. See it's all back. So I recommend that you periodically back up from PHP my admin. Remember if you've got cPanel, this is a cPanel demo, PHP my admin is under the databases area. If you're using something else like Dreamhost, it's a bit different there. It's easy to access PHP my admin and if you do have any issues, you can always talk to your host and say that you need to back up from PHP my admin. So thanks for watching. See you again soon. Bye.